guys, it's work, and it's the first Saturday of the month, which means it is yet another glorious USPSA match day. I am heading out there right now. Uh, the typical, you know, record really quick on the way to the match, because um, that's how I roll. Uh, I've been playing with my kids all morning, so can't really uh, do a lot of recording with that going on. But I uh, wanted to hop on here really quick to let you guys know about it. Uh, it is, it's November now, so it's chilly. It's not cold, it's actually supposed to be relatively warm today. Currently the temperature is 54 degrees. High today is 76, it's gonna be 73 about the time we're finished. Um, which means it's gonna be a nice temperature out, not too hot, not cold enough to make your hands all stiff. I've had that before, that's not fun. Because this match is after nationals, as is typical, we lose a lot of like the bigger players. Uh, so that adjusts my goals for the day a little bit. Uh, my goal for the day is top five. I don't know why I'm doing this to myself, <laughs> but but I think I think if I have a good day, I can make a top five uh, placement in here. There's good people still, don't get me wrong. It's just that um, I know at least two of the masters are gone. Um, just it's, that's what it, what happened. Heading out there right now, uh, we've already seen the stage rundowns. The stages look really fun. Uh, the classifier is not too bad. It's one of those classifiers where uh, points and time matters. So <laughs> I don't want to blast through it and miss my points, but I also don't want to take my sweet time and, uh, and you know, waste my time. But it's going to be a lot of fun. Um, there's a little bit of steel, a lot of cardboard. Um, not, not, I don't think there's a Texas star this time around, which is kind of nice for me, but I'm behind a bus and this bus is driving me insane. So um, we're heading out there. As I said, we're heading out there right now. Uh, Manny Things is shooting with us again today. So that should be fun. Builder is out today, unfortunately. Uh, he had something come up. I think we've got we've got Tim Othi shooting with us. So we've got a good squad again and I'm um, looking forward to it. I'm gonna get there a little bit early, so hopefully I can walk stages a little bit. So uh, I will see you when we get there. Okay guys, so we just got here. Looks like I'm not the only person recording today. There's a tripod back here, but um, I'm gonna walk the stages really quick. I ran through them yesterday with red dots um, just to kind of get an idea on paper of what we're looking at, but I'm gonna walk through them really quick. I don't have, I got about like 10 minutes until um, the shooters meeting. So I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys go while I run through this. All right guys, so we're getting ready for, we're getting ready for the shooters meeting. I am trying different ear pro today. I'm trying this in-ear stuff. I don't remember the brand name. I'll toss it down in the description. Um, but I, over ear just gets kind of wonky after a while. These things are, um, they're like 26 sound reduction. They are Bluetooth and um, amplified hearing. So it, it's kind of nice, I think, so far. Tried them out on Tuesday shooting with Builder for the first time and it worked really well. Hopefully they'll go well today. Um, also, repping the... Uh, Holler Sun shirt. This is coming off once we start shooting because honestly it just gets too warm, but right now it's a little chilly still. Um, as I said, we're waiting for the shooter meeting to start up, so we'll see you after that. <laughs> All right, guys, we got a hell of a squad today. We got we got good old Brandon here. Hey. Um, wait, I'm first now? <laughs> what just happened? So this stage is relatively simple. We've got one over here, three over here. Run over to the middle. Take the steel. Then we got a third spot over here. Where we'll take close, 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 far. So we're gonna start on the far end on the close, take steel, and then start on the close end on the far. I I think is what my game plan is. We'll see if that rolls or if I completely F it up. <laughs> Okay, so we just finished up the, uh, the fourth stage, technically, it's our first stage. Um, I went a little too slow for what I'm wanting to roll this time around, but I shot it clean, no no-shoots, uh, clean on steel, which actually put me at the highest hit factor. So, um, despite rolling slow on it, despite rolling slow on it, I did end up doing relatively well. Um, hey, Manny, how'd you do? I did fairly well. You um, didn't do bad. What'd you get? A three, three, one, three, one. But it was a 
all on steel misses. No, no shoots. I went. I was going a little bit faster this time, which is okay. It, it's preferred, but with no miss. Yeah, no, mi yeah. no, no misses, no mics, no no shoots. We're good. <laughs> all right, so we've got the our second stage, fifth stage of the match. Now we're gonna go walk it, and I'll see you guys as I'm shooting. So I just finished up that stage. I had a couple of makeup shots that I had to take on, um, I don't even think it was further targets, but uh, I knew that my stage plan was running really close on round count. So I changed my stage plan halfway through. I was gonna take, so I had the three first array, the three on the move, and then the tuxedo. Then I had three on the left, and that was gonna take me up to 20 rounds. So I took a couple of makeup shots and I didn't want to end on slide lock, so instead I changed my plan a little bit. I took the far, far left target that was uh, close to a 180 in fraction, went ahead and took that, then I reloaded and took the other two and then transitioned on to the far right. It created a uh, wide transition for me, but uh, it kept me from ending on slide lock, which I really didn't feel like doing. So I got a 6-1 hit factor on that one. Um, pretty happy with that so far. I've got the highest on the last one. I don't don't think I was highest on this one, but I'll I'll take it. It was relatively quick-ish, um, but I'm happy with it. I don't could have sped up my shots a little bit, and um, actually I couldn't because I, I I missed a lot. But yeah, so uh, finished with this one, and then we'll see you at the next one. Bye. Quick rundown of that one before they start shooting again. Uh, did okay. Had a couple of misses that I made up. Um, speed was a little bit better. Really liking these reloads I'm running. I'm running black bullets. Uh, and they're way nicer shooting than my just factory full metal jacket 115s. These are 125s. Um, but so far I'm super happy with it. Got a 6-8 hit factor on that one. Uh, so we will see how the next one rolls. And, uh, Unfortunately, I got two mics and I re-engaged one of the targets that I had already hit. Uh, hit factor was a 444, so did not do well on that one. Um, is what it is, yeah, but yeah, it happens. I uh, tried to go too quick through it. Um, I ran a little bit different stage plan as everybody else, uh, just to run a different stage plan than everybody else. 
Yeah, I'm not sure it paid off or not. We'll have to see when we get back to the times. But um, those two misses just really hurt me. I, the reacquire, like, or the re-engage, I'll deal with that. That's not too bad. But that, um, like, those two misses, they, they hurt a little bit. So next time, uh, we'll not be missing. I can never have like a whole good match, so that's okay though. I still, this one should be fun. This one is uh, three position with some steel. So here's the hope and I don't F that up. Bye. Ended on the fuck up. Uh, I had two foot faults in, so um, yeah, that one's not gonna be too hot. So I'll get back to you guys here in just a second. I'm gonna go check my score. Not so hot. Um, as I said, they said two foot faults. I didn't think I didn't think I was touching the ground at all between the two shots. I thought that I had held it above just in time and then stepped out, but. They disagree, so for how I started the day, did not end the day well. Not too happy with that, but it is what it is. So, no excuses, just wasn't a day. See you guys in a little bit. All right guys, I'm gonna record this while I'm putting stuff away rather than my normal in the car thing. So yeah, match is done. <sighs> did not do well. I don't know what it was, I started off super strong and then everything just went to shit halfway through my third stage. Just, I don't know, wasn't hitting my shots, wasn't uh, going fast, just nothing was quite right. So that's where today stands. Definitely did my, hit my goal of top five. It's one of those, one of those it is what it is moments. Not how I wanted to end this, uh, this year's matches, but I'll deal with it. Um, got a lot of dry fire stuff to do over the winter. Just gotta get better. <laughs> Biggest thing I gotta get more consistent. I do um, my reloads. These things are freaking awesome. Um, they were accurate and soft shooting. I just, I wasn't there today. <laughs> I did not show up for myself. I'll see you guys after all the scores come out, probably in the next couple of days or so. Hey guys, so uh, to close this thing out really quick, uh, first of all, I'm just in my basement. I didn't feel like prepping the background or anything. But um, so I finished off eighth overall with. Um, 66% of the points of the number one guy. Uh, I finished fifth in carry optics. Uh, there was a pretty heavy carry optics group this time around. I didn't yeah, read it beforehand, but there were a, lo a lot of them. And um, But still, I hit eighth overall. Still not happy with that. I really wanted that, uh, that top five on this one, and I think I could have gotten it, but I just um, kind of fell apart there in the last half. It, it happens. But uh, also, sorry about some of the audio stuff with it. Uh, the wind was picking up, and it was it was pretty windy. Um, doesn't affect shooting that much, but it does affect audio quality. So, sorry about that. But um, that is it for USPSA for this year, guys. Uh, we are done. Our next match will hopefully be next March, pending any, you know, corona crap. Um, but so we will get together next March. I got a lot of stuff I've got to practice before then. There was one stage in particular I went down low to, to take plate racks underneath some no-shoots and I completely lost my dot. I don't even know where the hell it went, but um, <laughs> I I completely lost it and that, that ate up probably two and a half seconds on that stage alone. And I already wasn't having a good stage that stage. So there's just a lot of stuff I need to work on and I knew that. My goal for next year is uh, right now I am uh, classed as a C-class shooter. Next year I hope to hit that B-class. Um, 
I was like half a percentage off from a B classifier this time around, and I took a lot of makeup shots on it. So next year, I think with the stuff that I'm planning on doing, I'll be able to hit that relatively easily uh, as far as, as my um, skill level goes, and uh, just go from there. Again, uh, next year, my goal is uh, top 10 every single time, and towards the end of the year, I hope to be able to hit that top 5 overall in our local group every time. Um, I also plan on hitting up at least one, maybe a couple more larger matches next year um, in addition to or maybe instead of some of the matches that we've been doing. Yeah, that's it, guys. That is USPSA for this year. We will see what happens over the winter. We'll see if I, uh, you know, switch guns, if I figure out a little bit better loading. Really liked the reloads that I ran this time. Um, they were healthy enough over power factor that I didn't have to worry about it, but they shot really soft compared to, like, my normal 115 factory ammo. So that pretty much comes to a wrap. Let me know, guys, if you uh, like these and you want to see more of these next year. If you've got something that you're working on or a goal that you're working towards next year for USPSA, go ahead and write that down in the comments below. Till then, I appreciate every one of you, and until next time, do your research, get informed, and get to work. Mm -hmm.